Hi, I am Lopa Mudrashen. Welcome back to my channel, Electronic Science Tutorial. From today, I will start a new lecture series on NTA UGC NET and West Bengal SET exam for Electronic Science subject. Those who are not check out my channel, please follow my channel. If you like my channel, then please do like, share and subscribe my channel. So let's start our class. In today's class, we discuss about the NTA UGC NET and West Bengal SET exam 2022. In this session, we cover in detail about this topic so that we can easily solve the previous year question paper of UGC NET Electronic Science. Each and every topic we can understand in easy and simple manner. So let's begin our NTA UGC NET exam 2022 class. Okay. Today I will talk about next important topic of semiconductor physics and devices that is non-degenerate semiconductor. What is non-degenerate semiconductor? If we add in dopant atoms to a semiconductor, what we assumed? We assumed that the concentration of dopant atom added is small when compared to the density of host or semiconductor atoms. What does it mean? It means the small number of impurity atoms are spread throughout the device and there is no interaction between the donor electron. Right? If we consider n-type material. Similarly, for p-type material it is also true. That is if we consider the small number of impurity atoms are spread throughout the device throughout the p-type material we consider that there is no interaction between the acceptor holes right so the few impurity atoms were so widely spaced throughout the sample we can say that no charge transport could take place within the donor or acceptor level. So we can assume that the impurities introduce that is discrete that is also non-interacting donor energy state in the n-type semiconductor and for p-type semiconductor it is also true it is discrete and it is non-interacting acceptor state for p-type semiconductor and this type of semiconductor is called non-degenerate semiconductor okay so for non-degenerate semiconductor we consider first we consider the dopant atom adding dopant atom is very small and this is spread throughout the device because these dopant atoms are very small in quantity and this small number of impurity atoms are spread far enough apart so that there is no interaction between the donor electrons for n-type material and acceptor holes for p-type material and this is this type of semiconductor is referred to as non-degenerate semiconductor. For non-degenerate semiconductor, the electron concentration is represented by N0 equal to NC exponential minus CC minus CF divided by KT. And for the whole concentration of non-degenerate semiconductor that is represented by P0 equal to NV exponential minus EF minus EV divided by KT. This two equation is already, we know about this equation. Okay, we talk about this topic. So this is the concept of non-degenerate semiconductor. Next we talk about the degenerate semiconductor. What is degenerate semiconductor?
so what is degenerate semiconductor if the impurity concentration increase the distance between the impurity atom decreases and in which point a point will be reached when donor electrons will begin to interact with each other for non degenerate semiconductor we saw that the for n type semiconductor we saw the discrete state and non interacting donor state but for when we increase the impurity concentration the distance between the impurity atoms are also decreases if we increase the impurity concentration the distance between the impurity atom decreases and a point will occur or a point will reached when donor electrons will begin to interact with each other okay so this single discrete energy state energy state will split into a band of energy as the donor concentration further we increase the band of donor states also widen and may overlap the bottom of the conduction band this overlap occurs when the donor concentration becomes comparable with the effective density of state function so we can say that the when the concentration of the electrons in the conduction band exceed the density of state function that is the nc value the fermi energy lies within the conduction band edge that means how does it like looks like that is it looks like this is the conduction band and this is the valence band and fermi level is lies within this this is the fermi level ef which lies within the conduction bandage this is the n type degenerate semiconductor device that means when the concentration of electrons in the conduction band exceed the density of state function that is nc we know the fermi energy lies within the conduction band and this type of semiconductor is called degenerate semiconductor for n type material similarly for degenerate semiconductor this is the fermi level position that is ef minus ec equal to kt ln n by nc plus 2 divided by minus 3 by 2 into n by nc this is for n type degenerate semiconductor in similar manner if we consider the acceptor doping concentration increases for a p type material the discrete energy discrete acceptor energy state is also split into a band of energy and it also overlap the top of the valence band and the fermi energy will lie in the valence band when the concentration of holes exit the density of state that means nv this type of semiconductor is called degenerate p type semiconductor how does it looks like it looks like this this is the valence bandage and this is the ef right this is the position of ef for degenerate p type semiconductor that means the fermi energy will lie in the valence band or into the valence band when the concentration of holes exceeds the density of state nv and this type of semiconductor is called degenerate p type semiconductor and how does it define it defined by ev minus ef equal to kt 
ln p by n v plus 2 to the power minus 3 by 2 p divided by n v and this equation is true for p type degenerate semiconductor right so this is the basic concept of non degenerate semiconductor and degenerate semiconductor okay Thank you. I hope you love this informative session of NTA UGC NET or West Bengal SET exam. If you like my video, then please do like, share, and subscribe my channel. Fir milte hai ek nai video ke saath. Thank you.